G'day Virgo, welcome to TJ Tarot Down Under. Going to do the love energy coming toward you. as that now? Current energy. See what's going on, hey? So this is a general reading. Take what resonates, leave the rest. If it doesn't resonate at all, you can check out your other placements or check out my playlist and see if something resonates for you there. Give me three cards for the love energy coming towards Virgo, please. Oh dear. <laughs> Crosswatches, this could be your energy. If not, it will be somebody else's. So keep that in mind. You may not be the only one interested in Virgo. Okay. We got the three. Let's get the clarifiers and then we can start. Um, all the decks are pre shuffled and a list of below in the description box in the order that I'm using them in case you're interested in what the decks are. Okay, clarify card number one please. Okay. Card number two please. ones and then that one okay card number three please yeah I don't pick the cards I let them jump out on their own okay all right let's see what we got Past life relationship, you've known each other before. Oh, Virgo. Yeah, thinking about you again. Temperance, patiently waiting. Knight of coins. Yeah, to come back in with some stable action. Seven of coins to invest in the situation after the heartbreak of the Three of Swords. Ah, in the past they um, waited too long, didn't take any stable action towards investing in this and ended up with heartbreak. Or breaking your heart. Alright, you want... okay. Okay, new love, a new person has stirred your romantic feelings. So they want new love with you, Virgo. The magician, that's what they're trying to manifest. The High Priestess, they're keeping it a secret. The Nine of Swords, that it's been a nightmare for them without you. Yeah, being single, Nine of Cups, the nightmare of being single. <coughs> Three of Cups, wanting this to come back together. Two of Swords, but unsure whether you want a new beginning with the Fool. Yeah. Uh, they want you, they want to have a new beginning with you, but they don't reckon that, yeah, they're not sure whether you'll take that chance. Pay attention to the red flags, the signs are cautioning you, yeah. And the Two of Wands. Hmm. Yeah, there's major red flags here about the, yeah, they caused major red flags, which they know, well, what action can they take to fix that? There's nothing, well, they don't know, they don't know how to, <sighs> you're waving red flags at them going, no, 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 I'm not interested, I'm not interested, I'm not interested. And they're trying to work out how they can, what action they can take to get around that. Because <clears throat> you are saying, holding up red stop signs, saying stop, go back, not interested mate, you've already hurt me enough. Whew. Alright. They know that though. Okay, give me three more cards for the love energy coming towards Virgo please. What else can you tell us? Okay. 
Oh, we'll want that one first. Okay. Let me go back. Oh, oh no, it's a bit messy. Let's tidy up. Whew. And yes, I fixed my sign so it doesn't fall. <laughs> Let's get the clarifiers. Clarify card number one in row two, please. Okay. Card number two, please, in row two. Hope you're all doing well, having a good day. And number three. So they've got Eagle Spirit Freedom. Mm, I think they wanted their freedom, but Ace of Cups, uh, Two of Wands. Yeah, now they're not so sure. Yeah, they wanted freedom to give their cup of love to whoever they wanted. Well, fill their own cup. Worried about their own. Now they're not so sure about if they want that freedom. Mm, four of Pentacles. Holding back. Justice. Mm. Holding back from doing the right thing is what I'm hearing. The Ten of Pentacles. Well, they've got their freedom, but now they want love, and they don't know what to do about it because they held back from. They hold, yeah. So that's holding them back, or holding on to. Well, yeah, they don't know what they're holding on to. Wanting to balance things out and get the long-term stability back with you again. They don't like their freedom. Yeah, they got this couple of. They don't know what to how to get it. Yeah. Yeah, they don't want. No, they don't like being free. They don't like being single. Okay, air spirit knowledge. Okay, with the empress. Hmm. I'm feeling this empress is you, Virgo, male or female, growing a beautiful empire. And they know that you can grow your own beautiful empire, that you can grow everything on your own without them. They know that. But they know that, <coughs> yeah, they could have had grown something with you if they had done the right thing. Mm. Bluebell Fairy Gratitude yeah, I can see them being grateful for any opportunity that you give them Page of Swords and the Two of Cups yep yep they're spying they're watching they're looking for that opportunity to come in and have another chance at Two of Cups with you. Be extremely grateful. If you would listen to what they have to say about how they feel about you. Ah. But, mm, I think they know they've caused too many red flags and too much pain in the past to for you to... Mm, Alright. Engagement. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Let go of control issues. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. And reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. Yeah, so they had a beautiful commitment with you. Where love was expressed by you. And they tried to control the situation. Now they want another chance. 
to give this relationship a chance. I'm wanting you to give it another chance. Hmm. Five of Swords, Mind Games Manipulation, Four of Cups, The Offer, Queen of Wands. That's you, male or female, looking hot, sexy, and fully confident, doing good on your own. Because Queen and King and Queen of Wands aren't married. And the Two of Cups, and that's why they love you. Yeah, the mind games and manipulation that they played, the sabotage that they did. They know you're probably not going to be interested in their offer. Because you're doing awesome on your own, but that's why they love you. <sighs> Passionate action to come charging in triumphantly to try and work on things. With you, I think that was you next. Oh, no. Yeah, try and work on things, but it's still all talk. You have that best love. And you show that best love. But that's all out of their hands now. Ooh. I don't, I don't take reversals. The house of stability is upside down for them, and that's the truth. <sighs> mm. Willow spirit, flexibility, elves, playfulness, water spirit, spirit, manifesting dreams, and crystal co crystal cave trust. Yeah, see, they thought the things were flexible that they could go and play and you know, act childish and play however they wanted, that, you know, you were flexible about that. They were flexible about that. And that, you know, and that was the dream they were trying to manifest here. But they broke your trust. So, yeah, by trying to control things with the power. So now all they can do is hope that they can this can rise from the ashes because it's dead. The phoenix is dead. It rises from the ashes. That's what they're hoping for. Because, yeah, they're not stable without you. They want your stability to, um, Virgo. <sighs> Seven of Cups, Seven of Pentacles, Two Sevens, the Judgment Card, and the Page of Cups, yeah. They know you have better options to invest in. There's a lot of confusion and illusion about them thinking whether you, yeah, very confused about whether you'll want to invest in them again, whether you'll give them that second chance if they apologise for being so controlling with the Emperor. And the cycle's closed out with the World card. Yeah. The cycle's closed out because of the cheating line still and Four of Cups. Now they don't know whether you'll accept their offer. You. Virgo, male or female, of love and stability and commitment. They're going to try and say everything that they can say to try and end this nightmare and find some happiness in this. Pain. Yeah, but they know it's most likely going to still still be a painful ending for them. Oh. Yeah, they know they messed up, Virgo. They know they messed up. Hmm. Yeah, I think they pretty much know that... Yeah. Well, they're hoping. What else? What would this love energy like to say to Virgo, please? Just one card. I don't want to love you. Okay. So, yeah, they're just after the stability. And that's what it keeps coming back to, doesn't it? The stability. You growing stuff for them. And them not, yeah. I don't want to love you. Okay. I 
They want you to love them. They don't want to love you. They want you to love them and give them everything. I'm afraid of these feelings. Ooh, maybe they uh, do have feelings for you. Not ready to be with you yet. Lying was easier than telling the truth. I am different now, but that's a lie. See? Lying's easier than telling the truth, saying that they're different now, but they're not. And they're not ready to be with you. Because <clears throat> they're too afraid to feel anything. They just want you to come back and make everything stable for them again. Because they can't handle it on their own. Oh, fair go. So, yeah, it's a warning. They're thinking about it. Oh, dear. Well, hmm, just so you know. But you're doing fine on your own. You're in Empress mode. You're building your own stuff. and <laughs> Queen of Wands, confident, sexy, doing well. <laughs> you're looking good, fair go. So you just keep doing you, all right? <laughs> Because I don't like this energy, where, what their intention is. It's not love, <sighs> that's for sure. They don't want to open up their feelings. They just want you to provide stability for them again. Ah, dear. All right. Well, that's your reading, Virgo. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Yeah, that's a warning. Um... Leave a nice comment, that'd be awesome. Like, thanks for the warning. <laughs> yeah, and thanks for watching. All the best, take care, good luck, and I'll catch you later.